Hi, so in this video we will learn how we can install the Keda on a Kubernetes. So there are several ways to install the Keda on the Kubernetes. The two popular one are the Helm chart and the another one is you can directly use the Keda file, Keda operator file and you can install over there. So let's try with the Helm chart. So first of all what we will have to do, we will have to update add the Helm repo on uh, our machine like uh, first of all when you go to the kubernetes cluster in azure this is an example of azure you can try ws or gke and you can take this credential and go to the cloud shell and just type this command ham repo at keda core https and this is a chart url so currently it is already existing but this is the simple url so you can install over there the another is ham repo update Okay, so update has been done and then you can install the kubectl create namespace keda. So first of all, you'll have to create the namespace for the keda. So namespace has been created and then installed the ham install keda command. I'll, I'll put all these commands in the resource section. You can try. It's very simple. Make sure that ham is installed if you are trying from the local. Otherwise, you can directly use the cloud shell where the cloud shell by default is in ham installed. So it's pretty easy for understanding. Okay, so the Keda is done. Now, if you want after completing everything, then if you want to uninstall the uh, Keda, then you can simply try this command. Okay. So it has been uninstalled. So another way is uh, you can try the another using this URL apply hyphen f and this file name the YAML. It will create all the necessary objects for the Keda. So it was already created. So this is the way that we can um, create. Just warning is given because the resource name is Keda is required. So this will the missing annotation will be patched automatic. So nothing to worry about much. And again, you if you want to uninstall using this way, then you can again the try the same. kubectl delete and provide the URL name. I will already attach on the resource section. So you can check it over there. So that's it. A simple installation. There are two ways. There are other ways, but these are the most popular ways. So that you can try it, and they are very easy ways to install the Keda initially. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.